Hello guys and dolls and welcome back to Beauty Inside a Box. Today I'm carrying my non-Disney Princess doll collection series and today I'll be showing you my collection for a really heavily suggested one. Um, I didn't realise she was so popular but there you go. She's also one of my favourite non-Disney princesses. It is Meg. There she is. Very tiny little picture of her on the DVD cover from the film Hercules. I really like her as a character, she's really feisty, um, really sarcastic, which I'm pretty sarcastic in my day to day life so I relate to that. And I think this film has some great songs and Meg sings an awesome song, Won't Say I'm In Love with the Muses. And yeah, I just really like her, I think she's really cool and you guys clearly seem to really like her as well. I really hope one day they add her to the Disney Princess lineup because I would love some more dolls of Meg. This is my first Meg. Megara doll. This is Fashion Secrets Megara. She was made at the same time of the movie's release and she's really cool, like an absolutely awesome doll. Her face doesn't look quite right, um, I think mostly because she's smiling and Megara normally kind of has like a bit of a smirk instead of a smile, but you know, she still looks really cute, really pretty. Um, her hair is glued perfectly into position and she's got this really cool little thing tying her hair up. Her hair on this doll is kind of like not my favourite quality, it's like just a big fluff ball, if you know what I mean. But you know, it's it does the trick. Um, and Meg's hair is quite kind of fluffy and curly in the film, so it kind of works. Her outfit is awesome, like really movie accurate, great colours, um, there are two layers, and this bit you can actually take off, like that, and then you pull these, and her skirt actually gets shorter. That's the kind of fashion secrets part. And when I pull her skirt up, you can see that she's got these really cool sandals on with ribbon that goes all the way up her leg. The only thing that is kind of annoying about this doll is this bit at the top here fell off pretty much as soon as I got her and I've tried to sew it back on but it doesn't look as good. It's kind of like lopsided now. But you know, it's she's still really cool and I love this thing she's got attached to her hands, this like shawl. It's really cool and it's got little coins hanging off it. Oh, did one of them fall off? I think one of them fell off. Um, so she's got three on this side and two on that side. She's really cool. I absolutely love this doll. She's probably one of my favourite vintage Disney dolls. This is my second Megara doll. Bye. She's really cool and uh, I used to actually have this doll when I was a kid. She was one of the more basic dolls. She came in just a little box um, and she didn't come with anything. But she's really cool. Like She's got really cute face. She's got a little band in her hair. And her hair is a lot less fluffy. Like you can run a brush through it quite easily. Yeah, and then she's got this cute little outfit on. It's got like a really cool little Grecian design, I think. Um, and I like the little pleated skirt. And she's got some golden sandals. Yeah, so that's the second one. Um, I really like her. I really like all my Megara dolls. I want more Meg dolls. The last one actually came in a set of two with Hercules, and I'll show you them both. And I've actually already done an unboxing review of these dolls. So if you wanna click the link, I'll put it somewhere on the screen, um, and I'll also put it in the description. Yeah, check that video out once you've finished with this one. But here they are. <laughs> They're awesome. These dolls were Legends of Love, Hercules, and Megara. I'll show you Meg first, since this is her video. She's got these big, long panels hanging down the side of her dress, which just look awesome. And obviously, I mean, I think this is kind of like meant to be like her wedding dress. This is what I'm kind of guessing. She's got some cute little earrings, this one, little gold earrings, and a gold hairband this time. And she's got really long brown hair, like longer than all the others. But her hair is also incredibly matted, like you can't run a brush through it, it's just like a complete mess. Her outfit's really cool, um, it reminds me of something like Aphrodite might wear. Yeah, really cool colours. It's got little kind of gold flowers here connecting her panels and a long, long, long bottom half which covers her feet and she's got the same gold sandals as the other one I just showed you. And she's just really cool, I absolutely love this doll. What do you guys think of her? She's awesome. And let me show you Hercules. Ta-da! There's another Hercules doll, which was just kind of like basic Hercules in his like day-to-day -day outfit. I um, mean, I used to have him as a kid and I absolutely loved him, but uh, he's gone. I played with him too much and he fell apart. But now I have this Hercules and he's really cool. And his colors kind of like match with Meg's colors, which is really cool. He's got this awesome little cape. 
which is a really nice floaty material. His face mold is really, really movie accurate in my opinion. And he's got his signature like headband. This one's gold to match the rest of the outfit. And he came with kind of handcuffs and uh, a sword, loads of great details. And obviously the crest of the gods from the movie. There's just loads of great details to this doll. He comes with his own sandals. And I always used to find it funny because he's got like little swirls for his nipples, um, which I always thought was quite funny. Uh, let me just show you. See, look, he's got like just a little swirl for his nipple. I always thought that was quite funny when I was a kid. <laughs> I had a weird sense of humor and I still do. So yeah, so that is my full collection of Megara dolls. Which one is your favourite? It's really hard to hold them all at once. <laughs> Comment down below, let me know which one's your favourite. Thank you so much for watching my Megara doll collection. If you want to check out some more videos in this series, there'll be a link to the playlist in the description and I'll probably put a link somewhere around here as well. Please like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video and I'll see you real soon doll fans. Bye! <laughs> see ya!